Oh yeah, so spoilers, I'm not gonna... <laughs> spoilers, I'm not taking that map. Not yet, I need to get the pesticide first. No, that wasn't part of our deal. Huh? But it's not necessary to destroy stars. Excuse me? Who's that? <laughs> what could he be talking about? Oh no. Hello? Jill. Barry! Barry, I heard someone talking. Oh, you heard. I Barry. Think it's just starting to take its toll. Talking to myself is becoming a bad habit. Talking to yourself? You all right? <laughs> no. <What's going laughs> <to you? laughs> this place is full of zombies and monsters, Jill. I'm getting worried, aren't I? But don't. I'm all right. I guess this creepy mansion has gotten to my nerves. Anyway, I think I'll go outside, get some fresh air for a change. Uh, Barry, Barry, please no, don't leave me alone. Barry, this is scary don't stuff worry. here. I'm just going to get some fresh air. If I'm lucky, I'll get to waste some monsters along the way. Barry, please be careful. Barry, please, don't do stupid stuff, Barry. God damn it! <laughs> What's this? Plant 42. Ah! Four days have passed since the accident. That plant is point 42. It's growing at an amazing rate. <laughs> Although there are many unknown aspects about this plant, we know that in comparison with the other group of plants, the T-Virus has had a substantially stronger effect on this one. <laughs> The T-Virus has drastically morphed its host anatomy as well as its size. Looking at its current state, it's difficult to imagine its original appearance. Nowhere on Earth are you going to find anything like this. <laughs> we have also found that Plant 42 has two main sources of acquiring its nutrients. One source is through its root. Somehow, it's rooted itself down into the basement. Immediately after the incident, a scientist went mad and destroyed the Aqua Wing. Ever since, the basement has been up like a pool. There's a high possibility that one of the chemicals in the water is promoting the growth of Plant 42. However, we have yet to determine the specific chemical. A bulb-like body on Plant 42 has been sighted hanging from the ceiling on the first floor. We are sure that it used the air ducts to reach the first floor. Nearest long tentacles and vines are protruding from the bulb. <clears throat> oh god, this voice is hurting me. Ugh. I need some more water. Ugh. <laughs> We believe the vines are the second means of acquiring its nutrients. When the plant 42 senses prey, it uses its tentacle-like vines to capture the prey, just like one of my Japanese hentais. <laughs> After doing, the suckers on the vine drain the prey of blood. We've also noted that it has some intelligence. When it captures its prey or when it's inactive, the vines twine around the doors to stop possible intruders. Unfortunately, several of our scientists have fallen victim to plant 42. When we heard the stories from the survivors, they all observed one thing in common. When the uniform petal-like flaps open and reveal its vital interns, it's like a tendency to become more aggressive. One witness reported that if it was as if it was trying to protect itself. Why it behaves that way, it's done. It's still unknown. Harry Sarton. Oh, so that's Plant 42. Hope you guys enjoyed the nerd. And, as you can notice... Oh my god, this is going to be one of those. I can't actually remember how to do this. I'm pretty sure I have to leave and come back, just so it resets itself. Or I'm going to the bathroom. That's also... That also works. Hello? What's this? Oh, I got the residence key. Oh, I guess, never mind, I didn't want it anyway. Alright. Which, was that for 201? I think this is for 201. Yep. So, 201. I mean... Can I drain the tub? It worked so well the first time. Oh, no! It's a zombie! F no! This <laughs> is I don't want to deal with you, zombie. Fuck off. 
Thanks, Barry. You're the best. Thanks for taking care of all of those monsters, Barry. Fucking Barry the asshole. More like it. Didn't take care of any zombies. So... Oh well. Well, let's go to 201, because I don't remember how to deal with, um... That... I don't know how to open that thing. I know you can push that shelf, but... I don't know what that does. So now, but now we have the residence key, we can use it. Oh, that's a gallery. I lied. Oh yeah, I have to go back through here. But da da more. So the reason we're not grabbing the map is because you do monsters spawn. And I don't have the pesticide to fight the monsters. That's right. No! Oh, I almost pulled a no-no. That no 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 almost got me hurt too. And for those curious, yes, we'll be using the 42 formula on plant 42 because I don't I don't want I don't feel like fighting with Barry, honestly. Like I don't feel like having him rescue me one more time. We can do this. We're big strong girl. We can do this on our own. Hello. Hello oh. That's depressing. Hey buddy. I guess he just couldn't do it anymore. Hey! Self defense gun! Suicide note. <coughs> I had to do it. We ran from those things helping each other survive, but Robert started to show the symptoms. I had to do it. Those damn things are pure evil. There was no other way. He would have done the same if it was the other way around. After I put him out of his misery, I had to just leave him to the bathroom. Now I'm probably the last one. How could this happen? I'll never forgive myself for being part of this project. Eventually I'll get what's coming to me though. There's no way to escape from this nut house. It's just a matter of time now. Everything is set. All I need is a little courage to get it done. Knowing I'll leave many things undone and regrets beyond words. Which is better than just waiting to turn into one of them. Please understand. At least let me end my life as a person. There isn't a message in the back. Linda, please forgive me. That's right, nerd fucking killed himself. What a cool kid. Yeah, I'll take the handgun mag. Oh, I also I also just fucked this up really bad. Because now, uh... Yeah, now I don't have any room. I have, uh... Oh, yeah, back. <laughs> oh, no! I entered the wrong door! No, thank you. I'll have to deal with this in two seconds. It's obviously one of those things I have to grab something from the bathroom. But first, I have to have inventory to grab it. Ugh. This is one of the things... I mean, I love item management in games. I just forgot how ridiculous the Resident Evil series was about item management. Like, this is... Like, I think you can get through this entire section without using the crank at all. I'm just being paranoid and keeping it. But I feel like I need it. <laughs> so I'm gonna drop the handgun bullets off. Um... Drop the self-defense gun off. There we go. Self-defense gun's cool. It does the highest... I, I believe, if I remember right, it does the more damage than the Magnum. But you also only get one shot. And it, you also have to be super, like, super duper close for it to be of any use whatsoever. Alright, now we go through here. Man. He could have, like, gone out the window. He didn't have to hang himself. He could, have, he, he could have escaped. It's full of dirty water. Yeah, let's pull the plug. That worked so well the last time we did it. Oh, look. Yeah, I'll take the key. Control room key. Ah! Ah! Zombies, they're coming to life! So now we have the control room key. That's nice. Oh, there we go. All better. So if you go for, if, if I would have done that in the opposite order, if I would have gone to the room after I got the control room key, the rope breaks and the guy comes back to life. But I didn't, cause I'm a cool kid. This is the con. Is this the key to the gal? This is the control room key. Uh. Well, I mean, the only lock door I have is the one over there, so I guess I might as well try it, but... 
I'm gonna have to go back to the original room because I can't. Ugh. My memory in this area is especially bad. Like the Volt 42 formula. I think I remember how to do most of it, but other than that, this is going to be a nightmare and a half. Turn the corner. Can I use it? No, it's door plate. What's he? Yeah, the only other door I can go through. That's the map, but I mean the map at this point is also pointless because I've already unlocked I've already been through every place except for the gallery. Alright. Oh, I'm itching my back and my leg and it feels so good, guys. Oh, dry skin's horrible. Let's see. I'm gonna slam the A button on everything. I forgot where to use it! Wait, do I have to examine this book? No, this is for this is for the um Oh I don't even need this book. This is for like Oh wait, what? Oh it's blank. Alright, so yeah. You have to use this on a puzzle later on. Actually I think I need to use it on the puzzle now. Oh, what the fuck is this? Huh? Oh! Haha! <laughs> I am the greatest! <laughs> I'm the greatest that ever was or ever will be, don't you forget it. Uh oh, I changed my mind. I don't like this part of the game. Hello? One sec. I believe this is a save room, actually. Oh, never mind. Alright, so you ready to do this? <laughs> I gotta push these all the way there now. <laughs> or else you get eaten. Yep, you get eaten if you don't do this, boys and girls. Now remember, if you ever see a box by the water, you kick that box in. I don't care if there's like an animal inside it, you kick the shit out of that box and put it in the water. That's just how you do. This is also the bane for any speedrunner from what I've seen of this game back in the day. It's just having to push these three takes so much unnecessary time. I would have rather, like that code I got with the billiards, I would have much rather have had to use it here. And just like to make a small bridge go across, then have to um, push these. There we go. And now we have a bridge across. Hey. Oh, green herb. Why not? Do I have the inventory space for it? <laughs> um, yeah, I guess. It's my green herb now. Oh, wait, well, now we're gonna get wet. So, are you ready for, like, another, like, semi boss? Oh, la di da da. I wonder if anything bad's gonna happen. Oh, man, this POV. I have two health items, right? Yeah, I should be fine. Oh, but it's Neptune! Oh, no, it's not Neptune, it's baby Neptunes. <laughs> Sharks, baby, please! Not like this! Sharks, baby, please! Not like- oh god. Guess I might as well use you. Yeah, so sharks! The kind of a-holes.